Hi, I'm Chris Ward for Elite Core Audio. I'm here at Full Compass today and we're going to take a very close look at how easy it is to get a great mix on a PM16 uh, personal monitor mixing system. You see, we have 16 uh, tracks playing uh, right now. Uh, all of the levels are turned all the way down. The blue knobs are our level controls. The gray knobs are our pan controls. And you can see the signal present lights are showing you which channels have certain things active. For example, this one is clicking. You can tell that's probably the click track. We'll listen. And that's awful and it sounds ugly, but that's the click. And you can put that click either in one ear or the other. Or you can click center. So we'll turn that down and listen to some other things and I'll show you how easy it is to get a great mix out of the PM16 system. We'll add some drums, add a little bit of bass, some percussion, maybe some piano. See some piano playing in there. There's organ, everybody loves a little organ. Let's take that organ and pan it off to the side just a bit. And acoustic guitar, this particular song is really driven by the acoustic guitar. So I'm going to, I'm going to take it up pretty loud in the mix. We've got some horns that come in and they're really fun when they do come in. And some strings. Then we've got electric guitars and there are actually four electric guitars on this particular mix. So we're going to turn, there, there, there's two on one channel and two on another channel. You'll see those. And then we've got singers. They're not singing right at the moment, but we'll turn them up. You can tell their lights are not active. Now yeah, there's some vocals coming back in for us there. So let's start off with the singers. And you can tell that you can hear them all quite well, but they seem all together. So we're gonna pan sopranos, altos, and tenors. We're gonna take them like that. And we have now put sopranos in one ear, tenors in another ear and uh, the, the uh, uh, altos there in the center. So it really gave you some room in your head. We're gonna do the same thing with these electric guitars. I'm gonna pan them hard left and hard right. And strings and horns, we're gonna do the same thing. And then this acoustic guitar, we're gonna give it a little bit of room, not all the way hard panned. And at that point, you've got a great general starting point of a mix. Now we could also compress this sound a bit with our single knob compressor. Compressor, And it squeezes the sound down just a little bit to give it some control. Or we could change the overall tonality with the graphic equalizer by adding some mid, taking some mid out, add a little sparkle with the high frequency control. Now it's again set uh, to flat. And overall, you've achieved a nice, good, uh, general mix. For example, if you were a, a, a certain musician, say you were uh, one of the, uh, uh, the people in the rhythm section, maybe the drummer, you're gonna wanna hear drums really loud and bass really loud, but a lot of these other instruments, you may not need so much, and you may only want just a tiny bit of vocals and these electric guitars can come way down in the mix as well, but bass and drums are very important and maybe a little bit of compression. So now you've got a great mix for uh, the drummer or the bass player. If you have any more questions about the PM16 system or how to operate it or optimize it, uh, you can check us out online at fullcompass.com or give us a call and talk to one of the sales professionals here at Full Compass. I'm Chris Ward for Elite Core.